Howdy ho, howdy ho. Welcome to my domain. It is an absolute mess right now, and Anthony and I are kind of messy people. What? I'm not messy. So we're pretty messy, but the thing is, is that we're not like usually dirty, we're just like messy people. We can live in a little bit of chaos. We actually thrive on it, I feel like, a little bit. Um, but it's out of control. It is like day five, day four of the astrology diet. So look at this. Rah, rah. Wah, wah, wah. You know, it's Capricorn season, y'all. We gotta get organized. We gotta get our plan together. We gotta get the bigger picture sorted out. So, here we go. I'm excited to sit down and relax in it. I have some like minor, like little drawers that I need to organize, which I'll show you all later, but it feels really nice. Y'all have not met my dog yet. Maybe on the live streams you've seen my doggy, but his name is Yogi. He's an Australian Shepherd and he has high anxiety stress levels. Poor baby, he's got problems. But we're working through them, okay? We're doing some energy work on him, but today he's getting a Santa cookie. This cookie is legit, by the way. I could eat this cookie. Okay, you wanna see him? Hi, baby! Okay, seriously, Capricorn season, y'all take note. This boy has some discipline and patience. Yogi Bear, you want your cookie? Cookie? You want your cookie? Cookie? Wait. Good boy. Good boy, baby. Good boy. Eat your cookie. Eat it. Good boy. Okay. I'll leave you alone. Enjoy it. All right, y'all. It's day five. Day five of the astrology diet. Um, it's been hard. You saw that mess that Anthony and I just cleaned up. <laughs> I just gotta be a little bit more organized. Um, and I think it's more of the daily, like I've been really thinking about it, it's more of the daily pickup, right? Like, it should never be that messy, but you know, the holidays comes, I know, I used to be in property management, so I know firsthand that a lot of people are messy, it's just life gets away from us, There's, that's not a big deal. Um, and I know that sometimes, like, I'm a big planner, but then it's hard for me to stick to my plan because I'm so spontaneous. Also, I really do things on the fly, like whatever I feel like. 
Um, so I'm really getting in touch with sticking to my plans. I am proud of myself though. I've been super disciplined. I just I put out the videos that I wanted to put out, so if you haven't checked those out, please do so. Uh, the affirmations video that I put out using I use, which is a, the Capricorn motto, so that is part of the astrology diet. Um, so definitely check that out if you haven't. And then also the tarot reading. The tarot reading, y'all, is for the new year, uh, specific to what you need to know about your career. I think that if you find yourself there, just give it a shot. It's not. It's not as scary as you think it is. It's more about getting in touch with your psyche, your subconscious, and learning and listening to the message that you're already, you already know them. It's just kind of like a validation um, to, to really develop yourself. So definitely check that out. That should be, if you find yourself there, just know that the message that you receive is really for you. Now, of course, it is a general reading, reading for like the mass population. So it, you know, leave what doesn't speak to you and take what does. Like I said, you already know what you need to do. You already know the message, just me reading laying it back to you so you can have that validation um so definitely check that out but yeah just going into the second week pretty much uh looking to do a vision board looking to get the big picture out there um and really identify the things that i really want because i'm learning that when we're manifesting i've been doing a lot of research and we're, when we're manifesting i mean we really can't um, we really can't manifest without knowing exactly what we want because the universe will send you something and then you're like, oh no, I changed my mind. And then the universe is like, well, hold on. I just sent you that. So now what? And then they have to, you have to start the manifestation process all over. Um, so really getting in touch with what I want, that's like key. And I feel like that's really key for organization too. So the videos have been helping, that's for sure. I have my calendar all planned out and I'm trying to stick to it as close to it as possible. I'm definitely not perfect. I'm definitely not sticking to it 100%, but I'm sticking to it like 95%, so I feel like that's pretty good, right? Okay, <laughs> thank you so much for that external validation. <laughs> if you felt like this video brought a little light to your life, please hit that like button and subscribe and comment below. Like, are you participating in the astrology diet? Was my house crazy? Did it make you cringe? Did it make you shudder? Uh, what are you working on? Even if it's not Capricorn related, but especially if it is Capricorn related. Um, otherwise, y'all, don't forget to share the magic. You're absolutely worthy of all that you desire. And I love you so much. I'll see you in the next video. Come. Sit. Oh, who's a good boy? Paw. Paw.